it's the happiness you feel. And today I'm together with, and who are you? Marie Wilman. And uh, who do we got down here? This is Hope. Say hi, Hope. And, and Hope has a, a special story. Let's uh, hear about that, Marie. What do you want to, what's about Hope? So uh, on October 4th, uh, we got a video, uh, we being a group of animal health, uh, animal care, an animal care group on WeChat, we got a video of a dog that was carrying herself around by her front paws, her back end was completely paralyzed. Uh, it was really heartbreaking and she was kind of being chased by kids and um, there were about seven or eight of us that all kind of got involved uh, and came together and rescued her. Uh, it took about a month uh, of recovery time on antibiotics to get the swelling down and to get her healthy and then after a month uh, the vet here at right behind me, Rupang Vet, uh, did a surgery that completely changed Hope's life uh, and through that time we found out that her back had actually been broken by an abuser. Um, we thought she was hit by a car but it turned out that she had been uh, badly abused to the point where there was a, an actual fracture in her spine but the vet here was able to uh, weld her spine back together essentially and now we are here less than two months later and hope is walking around like a little champion she's fought her way through and just uh she's really given hope to all the people out there that try to help animals because sometimes we can't help them even when they don't seem like they're helpable so, so now you might ask yourself how can i help making sure that these dogs they make it well in this life how can they help how can people help uh, well, I, I help by making posters, of course, um, but I've also fostered animals and fostering is actually one of the greatest gifts you can give to an animal, really. Um, by fostering, you take an animal into your home, uh, give them the one-on-one -on -one time, teach them that people are friends, give them the one-on-one -on -one training time, teach them you know, how to do their business outside and how to sit and play fetch and, and walk on a leash and things like that. Uh, and it's, I can't even express how important that one-on-one that -on -one time is. Um, because if they're not being fostered, they're being boarded at the vet. And that costs money and it also doesn't help them be socialized. Uh, so by fostering, you help socialize these dogs and you also help them uh, get a good start at life and, and give them the opportunity to become the best dogs that they could possibly become. Um, so even if you can't adopt a dog, fostering, short term or long term, is also a, an option. And you can pretty much contact me anytime and I will have a dog that you can foster. <laughs> There's definitely a need. So I'm thinking, and this is really, really a personal question, why, Marie? Why do you do this? What is, what's in it for you? What does it do to you as a person? Uh, I, I mean, I'm a teacher and I find teaching to be incredibly rewarding and I'm a musician and I find that rewarding and I'm a blogger and I find that rewarding but there's something about helping animals that I know wouldn't survive without me and wouldn't survive without you and wouldn't survive without you know the things that people are doing there's there's nothing that really compares to that it's um it's one of the best feelings in the world and I know that there are maybe 50 dogs I won't help but that one dog I can help like hope you know being able to help hope seeing her wag her tail and seeing her walk on her own when just two months ago she was found dragging herself along the sidewalk completely paralyzed in her back end you know seeing her um seeing her survive and seeing her thrive and become this awesome adoptable wonderful dog that's what's in it for me <laughs> definitely what's in it for me so what you can do funding it means we can donate money yes. we can foster kittens and dogs because it's not only about dogs no it would be actually any kind of animal that needs help yeah and uh, you can repost so if you make friends with the Marie on uh, Facebook or WeChat mm -hmm. you can repost uh, adoption or donation so helping can be done in many many ways absolutely 